Hi pals, it's Rich and I'm back today with Godzilla vs. Kaiju in the spinning wheel slime game. To play, put in the comments which of these characters has the slime and let's see if you're a winner. Is it Godzilla? Hidora? King Hidora? Violante? King Kong? Gamera? Godzilla from King of the Monsters? Meltdown Godzilla? Rodan? Or Mecha Godzilla. Put your answer in the comments and let's see if you're a winner. At the end of the video, we also have more fan art mail. So stay tuned and let's get to spin it. Let's spin the wheel. Oh, cool. We got Meltdown Godzilla or Burning Godzilla on the first spin. So let's see. Meltdown Godzilla. Do you got the slime? I don't think so, but let's punch and find out. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Wait, there's nothing in there. But wait, I hear something coming. Cool. What's that? Cool. And it's the figure, the instructions, which are going to be really hard to read. First thing is the actual Meltdown Godzilla. Look at this thing. Whoa. Now this is cool. And it says, hi, this is Godzilla. Very cool. Look at this figure. Nice. It's rubbery. It's not a real, real high quality figure, but it's pretty cool. His legs move a little bit. His arms move just a little bit in and out. His head moves. Pretty neat. He's about a six inch figure. Like it. I like it a lot. Now this is the interesting part. What is this? It's like some kind of stand with a god, the little dude on it. Got a little Godzilla head, another little base, and a Godzilla tail. So this little dude looks pretty cool. What is this? It's like a, look at that, it's like a headband he's got on. Or you could put the Godzilla head on it. Stick this Godzilla on top, like that. There it is. Okay, cool. And then it looks like you pull this out. This was made in, oh my goodness. 1995 or 2005, either way, it's old. All right, let's take that out. What is this? It goes on here, like that. And then you've got a little tail. It goes in the back, like that. Whoa, now that is pretty cool. Now wait, what is this other piece? This is like another headpiece, an alternative headpiece for him. Pretty cool, let's see. Oh, okay. oh wait. Doing a little dance. So look, you can take off the Godzilla head and then you can put on this, whoa, this hat bandana thing, kind of like to the side, and then you can have your dude doing the Godzilla shimmy shake. Look at him. That's pretty, pretty funny. So pretty cool. You never know what you're gonna get from Japan when you order this stuff. It's a novelty collector's item. Everything Godzilla is a collector's item. That's enough of this. We're gonna have to move on because we've got to find out who's got the slime. So let's spin it. Before we spin it, take a look at this close-up of this postcard. It's got King Kong, it says Kaiju fighting Godzilla, which is crazy. All right, let's spin it. Spin that wheel. All right, sweet, we got Hedora, AKA the Smog Monster. He could possibly have it. He's kind of a slimy type of dude. He's made up of all kinds of toxins, pollutants, slime, sludge, vomit, all kinds of stuff. So let's see if you got the slime. Here we go. One, two, three. Nope, no slime, but we got this. Whoa, look at Hedora. Cool. He does look like the smog monster. He looks like Hedora. Let's see, his head doesn't articulate, but his arms move a little bit. His legs don't. His tail moves a little bit. He's a little rubber classic figure. Wow, this is pretty cool. I like how he moves his arms out like that. Rrr, smog monster's gonna get you. So Hedora first appeared in the 1971 movie Godzilla vs. Hedora. And he's as cold as smog monster as well. And he fed on pollutants in the water. He ravaged Japan. And then what happened? And then Godzilla lit him up, baby. He lit you up. Yeah, I know. But that's all right. Pretty cool. All right, Smog Monster. This is the first Hedora we've ever got on the channel. I'm so psyched. All right, we got to keep moving on, Hedora. Let's spin it. Oh, we got my man, Godzilla. What is up, Godzilla? What is up? 
I know you don't have the slime, so let's just punch it and see what's inside of you. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Nope, no slime. There he is. Oh, this is a nice little Godzilla figure. Love it. So cool. Take a look at him. He's got nice detail to him. He's got that extra long tail. You can see in this picture on the box, you can see he's also shooting out of his tail, which is sweet. Pretty cool. I think that this is a real cool one. So this is obviously from the Shin Godzilla movie. I like these characters. I have never seen these before. These are obviously a Japanese release of a toy. I don't think they were ever released here. I don't remember seeing them. Pretty, pretty cool. All right, let's move on and see what else we get. Let's spin it with you. Oh, we got Biolante. Okay, Biolante. I don't know if you got the slime, but we're gonna find out. You genetically modified Rose and a scientist daughter. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Oh, no slime, but wait. What do we got? Oh, look at this. We've got the actual Biolante. Look at him. He's coming out. Look at how scary he looks. Whoa, this is awesome. Come on, Biolante. Can you make it out? Can you do it? You gonna break the punch box? No, you did it. Whoa, now this is a cool figure. Look at this thing. This thing is wild. Wow. How many heads has he got? He got seven heads. Take a look. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. And the big one in the middle, seven. Yes, and you did hear me right. He is a genetically modified, or she is a genetically modified, modified rose. The scientist in the movie, he mixed the DNA of a rose with the DNA of his daughter, so this Biolante has the personality and consciousness of his daughter. What? That's kind of crazy. This figure is really sweet. Each of the different necks articulates itself separately, so you can do some sick stuff with this. And his head actually, her head actually moves too. Biolante is sweet. Now she moves real slow because she's like a plant form. It's not a carnivore, it's the first plant form. So I got a super bonus question for you, pal. Here it is. If the Godzilla destroys Biolante in the 1989 movie, Godzilla vs. Biolante, what is thought to have happened to the particles from Biolante as they drifted into space? What character did it form? in future video or in a future movie right now you can put your answer in the comments or you can vote on the poll is it mecha king Ghidorah? is it mecha godzilla is it space godzilla or is it something else and if it's something else put it in the comments all right cool i love this figure i can play with this one forever this is going on my desk love it love it love it all right but we gotta move on because we gotta find out who got the slime? Let's go! Let's spin it! Alright, we got Gamera! Now Gamera is Godzilla's rival! Ooh, Godzilla's rival! He was made to compete with Godzilla in the movies! So let's see! Are you competing here? Do you got the slime? Let's give you a punch and find out! Here we go! One, two, three! Oh, nothing's inside! Whoa, look at this dude, man. This dude is crazy. Whoa, nice figure. I've never seen one of these Gamera action figures before, but this thing is awesome. Wow, they say that he's kind of like a, a, a vampire, a vampire bat, and they kind of said, they also kind of said that he is probably extraterrestrial. And that means he's from like outer space or something like that. Now look, he's got a hole right in his mouth. Now I think I know what that's for. That's for this thing. I think it shoots right out. This piece here looks like his tongue or some kind of projectile comes out of his mouth. Let's see. There it is. Like that. Look at that. Now that's cool. Now let's see. Can he shoot that thing out? All right, so cool. You just stick this little missile in there. You got to line up the grooves, which are up vertically. And then you turn it like this, and you're gonna shoot it. And to shoot it, you just kinda push it to the side like that. It shoots out. So it shoots pretty decent, too. This is a pretty nice figure. I mean, this is high quality plastic. It articulates really well. It's got 
like sound. It's it, this is a pretty pretty cool dude, I must admit. And I like it that it has a shooting part too. Shooting stuff certainly makes life cooler. So I got another super bonus question for you, pals. Two parts. Part one, when was the first Gamera movie released? What year? And how many Gamera movies were released all together through the last one in 2006, which is Gamera the Brave? Put your answers in the comments, and we'll see if you're a smart winner, too. All right, cool, let's move on. We gotta go, guys. Bye. Spin that wheel. Oh, cool, we got Rodan, he's my man. I loved him in the new King of Monsters movie. I loved that scene when he was flying over, like, wiping everything out below. Man, that was a sweet scene. All right, Rodan, don't you slime us, my man. Here we go, on the count of three. Ready, one. Two, three. Nope, no slime. And what do we get? Box. There he is. Oh, Dan. What's up, buddy? There he is. He's plastic. He's kind of nothing articulates. He's a cheap little figure, but he's cool for a collection and for a little blind box. Not bad at all, Rodan. He was, remember that scene? He was like this. Right over, I think it was like uh, some Mexican town, and it was just it, everything just lit on fire behind it. It was like a trail of destruction. Loved it. Rodan is my man. But, Rodan, you don't got the slime. And we're down to four. So if you did not guess, here's your last chance to play. Is it Mechagodzilla? King Ghidorah? Godzilla from King of the Monsters? Or is it King Kong? Put your answer in the comments now. Let's spin and find out. Let's spin it. Alright, cool, we got King Ghidorah. In my opinion, King Ghidorah stole the show in King of the Monsters. That was some serious CGI animation. So let's see, King Ghidorah. I don't think you got slime because I can see around the sides. But we're gonna punch it anyway. Let's find out. Here we go. One, two, three. Nope, no King Ghidorah. Looks like Godzilla's. Was that a baseball bat? Godzilla's holding a baseball bat, man. I didn't know you played Godzilla. You know what? Actually, I do. There is one baseball player that was called Godzilla. I know his name, and he is awesome. He won a World Series. So here's another bonus question. If you know who they used to call Godzilla, he batted lefty, and he played for a team that I liked. Put it in the comments. That's the mega super bonus question. If you don't know, ask your dad. All right, so this is kind of whack. It's like a finger puppet that you just kind of goof around with. I don't know where I got this from. Go ahead on his head. Look at that. Rodan, what's up, man? It's a Rodan Godzilla. <sighs> All right, enough of that. Let's move on and let's spin with something, something. We got to find who got the slime. Spin it, wheel. All right, we got Mecha Godzilla. All right, Mecha Godzilla, do you got the slime? Let's see what you got. Here we go on the count of three. One, two, three. Nope, no slime. And there he is. Oh, cool. Nice Godzilla. Man, you can tell he's got these super spikes in the back, scales in the back. I mean, he looks sweet. Compare him to the other Godzilla. All right, cool. Which one is better? 2016 or 2017? Mm, this I think 2016 is cooler, but they're both kind of cool. I don't know. Pretty neat. They're good little figures. They articulate a little teeny bit. Whatever. They're good. They're plastic. They're good for toys. These are good mini toys for kids to play with. Not collector quality, but toy quality, thumbs up. Sweet. All right, let's move on. We got two left. We got Godzilla from King of the Monsters, and we got, uh-oh, King Kong. That looks, sounds like a... Sounds like a preview of a movie to come next year. Ah, uh, it's gonna be hot. Let's find out. Let's spin that wheel. Oh, we got Godzilla, King of the Monsters. All right, here's the moment of truth. Let's see what you got, Godzilla. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. Nope, nope. Oh, sweet. I love these little vinyl figures, too. Oh, look at that. We got Mecha Godzilla. Nice! I love this guy. He is sweet. These kid robot figures are perfect for little collector's items or they can be used as toys too. 
I mean, they're very durable because they're just like some plastic. Ain't no big deal. Oh, we got an old school Godzilla. Look at that. He's got the unibrow. Let's call him unibrow Godzilla. Look at him. He looks pretty sweet. His little arms move too. You can fight, man. I'm bigger than you. All right, whatever, guys. We got to move on. There's no reason to spin. We're going to find out if King Kong got the slime. Mm-hmm. I think so. So let's give it a punch. Ready? Here we go on a count of three. One, two, three. Oh, it is the slime. No. It's the infamous green slime from Toy Pals. Oh, no. Wait, there's a fly bag in there from Kid Robot. Nice. Look at all this slime. This is the green slime. This is just like Hedora, the smog monster. Oh, love it. Whoa, cool. All right, so if you picked King Kong had the slime, put I'm a winner in the comments. Congratulations. And if you didn't, you should have known I was going to pick King Kong. Come on. Next time you can get that, right? Look at that. That's pretty cool. Put my hand in there. Mm -mm. See my handprint? Love it. Sweet. Look at this. Dang, Godzilla. Make it Godzilla. Y'all messed up. So pretty cool. Pretty cool. Oh, man. Look what it is. Oh, bro. Damn. What is up? I didn't get this one in the last video. Oh, I love it. And look, he's got the wings that you gotta put on. Look at that. Look at that. What's up, bro, Dan? What's up, my man, Rich? Oh, cool. You wanna jump in the slime? Heck no. I'm out of here later. So pretty cool. We got a lot of cool stuff. And now we're gonna be opening up some cool fan art mail. Looks like Biolante, you should be hanging out in the slime, bro. All right, and you too, Hedora. Come on, get in the slime. That's where you belong. Look at that, melting Godzilla. Gaio's figure was sweet. Man, we got some good stuff in this in this video. This is some unique stuff. You don't see this everywhere, pals. All right, so let's get the fan mail. Here comes a load of it right here. Look at that. Oh, that's some good stuff. All right, let's get to opening this. All right, here we go. Remember, if I didn't get to yours yet, I will soon. Whoa. Oh, Kalen! I love your King of the Monsters! Look! There's Godzilla. This is Gigan, I believe. Gigan! Whoa, look at this. They're destroying the city. Love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Caleb. Love it. Very cool. I love the magic markers. Makes it pop. Oh, this is from Evanland. Whoa, look at that. Love it, love it, love it. It says, hey, pals, it's rich. Oh, cool from Evanland. Love it. Look at this dinosaur. This dude's cool. He's saying something like, run. Look, it's Rodan in the background. And look, I think it's a dinosaur egg or a coconut, something like that. I don't know. Thank you, Evan. It's really nice. Good job. And the colors are popping. Popping. Look at that. You can kind of put it down like that. It looks like a scene. Love it. All right, let's move on to the next one. Rich, I love your Godzilla collection from Sam. All right, Sam. I like that. Whoa, this is Mickey Godzilla. Love it. Cool. Look, you got the right colors. All good. Looks great. Nice. You got more. This is Godzilla versus King Kong. That's appropriate for what we did today. Look at King Kong, man. He looks crazy. Godzilla's giving him the atomic breath, though. He's like, what's up? All right, cool. And now, King Ghidorah, the man. It's tough because he's in yellow on this, but very good, Sam. I love it. And Destroyer. Destroyer looks sweet. Excellent job, Sam. Thank you. Thumbs up. Uh oh, this one's got three little packages in it. Here's the first one. To Gwen. Whoa. This is Godzilla. In theaters, May 2019. Sweet. You colored this in great. To Quinn. Or to Quinn or to Quinn. All right, and then you got a couple more. You ain't messing around. You got these things taped down. Whoa, Rodan. That's right, my man, Rodan. Nice. Good job coloring them. Right color. Red. Oh, look at that. Now, that's cool. That's popping. That's popping. Godzilla's lighting it up. Sweet. Thank you, Tiguan, from Easton, Pennsylvania. All right, what do we got here? Looks like a colorful one. Whoa, look at that. 
My name is Zeke. I am eight years old. This is a green anaconda. This thing is sweet, man. I'd be scary to see that thing in the, in the jungle. You better run the other way. What's on that? That looks like Mothra on that side. Thank you very much, Zeke. Zeke, I like that name. That's a good name. It's my boy, my running back. All right, let's get to the next one. Oh, this, my name is Eli, this is Rodan. Man, Rodan is making an appearance today. I am seven years old. This looks really good. I like this, Eli. King of the monsters, that is nice. Rodan is representing today. That's right, Mr. Rich, I'm representing. I told you, I like Rodan a lot, and I get all these Rodan drawings today. This is some real serious karma going on here. All right, let's see what else you got for me, Eli. Oh, ho, 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 look at this. Bang! There is more on the back page. Oh, look at that. There's one of the heads of King Ghidorah fighting Godzilla over there. Pretty nice. And now let's see. Oh, man. Oh, look at that. Godzilla's eating one of Ghidorah's heads. Nice. That is some sweet drawing, man. I like it. I mean, you guys are talented. Better than I was when I was your age. All right, we got another one. What does it say? What would Pokemon you have? Cooper and Rich and Elena. What? How do you know all our names? You must be a real fan back in there. Whoever wrote this one says, you ate cool too. What? This is awesome. Of rich male. Things of rich male. Guys, little things. What is this, man? This is cool. This is like some scratch off. Look at that. This is some, this thing is awesome. That's really cool. All right, what else did you got here? Says, Miguel. What's up, Miguel? This one is crazy, man. This is what I'm talking about. That looks like Biolante over there. There's a nuke. This is Godzilla over here. This looks like Rodan up in there. An airplane coming here. A nuclear bomb over there. Tanks over here. Man, that's cool. That's crazy stuff. I like that one. I like that one. And let's see what else we got. Whoa, got me another one. Look at this. By Miguel. Miguel, man, you got some good skills, my man. All right, pretty, pretty cool. Look at this, that's Biolante, that's uh, King Ghidorah, and then Rodan, and that could probably be Godzilla, or Little Godzilla, or somebody. King of the Monsters, love it, Miguel. Thumbs up, thanks, bro. Rich, I love your videos, please make more. I just did, I just made a video, doing my best. Doing my best, I know, it's not that good. Dear Rich, you're cool, love your videos. Put Godzilla in the punch box, just did it for you, my man. Godzilla, there's Ghidorah at the back, what? King Ghidorah by Jeremy. Thank you, Jeremy. That's a good freehand drawing of King Ghidorah. I love it. I love it. He is he has gotta be my favorite. You're right. Alright, so that's cool. Here's Rodan. Oh, Rodan's on the back. Mothra over here. Rodan. Look at that. Rodan's coming in, man. He's coming in to get you. That is really cool. Really cool. Thank you, thank you very much. I do appreciate it, Jeremy. All right, cool deal. Here is the last one. It says, I love your videos, Rich. Oh, this looks like a good one. Oh, Baryonyx, T-Rex, Spino. Look at that, man. That's some color popping stuff there, too. Meat. It's meat. This is meat. Oh, who is this from? Oh, I don't have a name. Oh, it's from Freddy. What's up, Freddy? This is awesome. Thank you, Freddy. I think this came over from England. I love what you did. Thumbs up. I had a great time making this video, and I had even a better time reading all the fan art mail and showing it all. It is really my best part of my videos. So thanks for watching, pals. Remember, give this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and subscribe to Toy Pals TV for more cool Godzilla spinning wheel slime games. And remember, pals, most of all, don't be a bully. Be nice to the kids in school. It really makes a big difference. You know if somebody's mean to you, you don't like it. So don't be mean to them. Stick up for kids getting bullied. Thanks for watching, pals. We'll see you soon.